Oh, hi. Welcome to the Teddy Bear Workshop presented by the Charles County Public Library. I'm here right now on the mobile library where we have lots of books and materials for you to check out and read. We also have these kits, Teddy Bear Workshop kits. If you picked up a kit and you're ready to join me in making your own Now this teddy bear is nice and fluffy and soft. He comes in the kit along with a book that you get to keep for yourself. And it's called My Friend Bear. And it's written by Jez Alvaro. Now, also in your kit, you of course will have a bear that needs some stuffing. Some stuffing so you can stuff your bear. Your very own book. A birth certificate for your bear. And last and not least, a rainbow star. We'll talk about this later. So first, oh, how could I forget? You also get a nice tote. You can keep all of your things from the teddy bear workshop in your tote bag. So I'm gonna put in the birth certificate, the book, because I want to keep it safe. And the rest of the things I'm gonna keep out. Because now, it's time to make a teddy bear. You'll also need to have a pair of scissors. Make sure you have a grown-up with you who can watch you use the scissors. The scissors will be used to open our stuffing pack. So let's get started. First, I'm going to turn my bear over there's an opening here where all the stuffing will go and you'll notice there's a string tied to this zipper leave that string there we'll use that later now I'm going to take my scissors I'm going to open my stuffing I'm just going to cut the packet open and wow did you see how fat it got? Must be a lot of stuffing in there. So, when you're ready to stuff your bear, make sure you stuff their arms first, then their legs, and then stuff the bear's belly. I want my bear to be a little floppier, so I'm not gonna put a lot of stuff in. I'm not gonna use all of this. If you want your bear to be nice and full, you might wanna use all of your stuffing, but it's totally up to you. Let's stuff. So I'm going to take out the stuffing. It's just like soft white cotton. Take a little bit and I'm gonna stuff this on. Yep, that's good. And I'm going to stuff a little over here. Uh huh? Now for the legs. Just a little more of the stuffing and you can just grab as much or as little as you would like to his leg, this bear's leg, a little more for the other leg. It's really easy. Very good. Next, I'm going to take, I think I'll try this much, but remember, I don't want my bear to be really, really full. 
So let's see. I still want my bear to have some floppiness. So I'm gonna stick it in the bear's belly and just kind of flatten it out and spread it out inside. I'm gonna pick it up and see. Oh, I think that's just like I want it. How about you? Have you finished stuffing your bear? Great. Now, don't need any more of my stuffing. My bear is perfect. And I don't need these scissors. I do need my rainbow star. Now that you've finished stuffing your bear, get your special rainbow star. We have to make a wish before we put our star inside our bear. Now, stars are usually in the sky, so let's wave our stars high above our heads, way up in the sky. And this will help our star to get lots and lots and lots of magic. Okay, now that we've done that, let's take our star. We're gonna close our eyes. And when I say three, you're gonna give your star a kiss and make a wish. So close your eyes. One, two, three. Give a kiss. And make a wish. Don't tell anybody your wish. Okay, now that we've made our wish, we're going to, hmm, how can we make sure that our bear knows that we love the bear? I know. Rub the, the star on your heart so your bear will know how much you love the bear. And now, take your star and rub it on your head so we can make our bear nice and smart, just like you. Oh, and rub the bear star on your eyes. This will make sure that the bear can see you when you give him a hug. Next. Take your star, rub it on your ears so when your bear hears you speak, they will know it's you talking. And now we're going to give our star one more kiss. When I say three, one, two, three, Mwah! and stick it in your bear. Tucked in nice and tight. I hope you got yours in too. Now that we've got our rainbow stars in our bears, we're going to take this string and we're going to tuck in this little tail part. Hold the string in one hand and tuck the tail in with the other. And now you can see that you can pull the string to zip up the back of your bear. This is going to make sure that the stuffing stays inside and that your rainbow star stays inside too. So now I'm just gonna pull the string all closed. I'm gonna tuck this in too. All closed. Now, just stuff that pocket into your bear's back. And then there's some Velcro, the soft side and the prickly side. Now the prickly side may have some bear fur on it. Just rub that off, pull it out of there because we want to use the Velcro to close our bear, make them secure. So you take this side and stick it to that side and pinch. You may even hear a little crunch. You hear that? Great. And now you've got 
got your very own bear. Now you'll need to name your bear. What would you like your name, your bear to be named? I like that name. I think I'm going to name this bear Charlie. Charlie Bear, welcome to the world. Charlie, you sit there. And now this is where you and your grown-up can complete your birth certificate for your bear. On this top line, you're going to write your bear's birthday, which would be today's date. Write it there on the line. Write your bear's name on this line. What color is your bear's fur? Write that here. What color are your bear's eyes? Write that here. And this bear belongs to, put your name right there. The location, that means where you made your bear. Write that on this line. And the very last line is for your grown up to write their name because they saw when your bear was born. Well, that's all that we have to do today. I hope that when you get an opportunity, you, your bear, will sit down with this book, My Friend Bear, and enjoy a good story. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.